Today's October 25th, 2015. What's up, everybody? I just got a, some music that was sent to me earlier uh, in the week by a guy named Jones A. So I went to, he asked me to review his music, take a listen to it, and tell him what I think. So this is one of the ways that I'm going to start listening to music and reviewing it. Um, it's a uh, mastered by Fuse Media, produced by C Dub and Mob Music. First single for the upcoming uh, debut album, which I have no idea what the name is yet at this point. But uh, we're gonna check it out. This is my first time listening to it, so let's uh, see what it's all about. Mom, you these avenues, get it correct, bitch. That's what's up. Grinding on my power moves, get it correct, bitch. That's what's up. Catch me pushing tough like a mad truck, get it correct, bitch. That's what's up. Still on my seven shit, get it correct, bitch. That's what's up. Gotta get away from, man. Get it correct, bitch. That's what's up. From a place that they call UTA, yeah. Suckers talk shit, better know your place. Top dog down the scrap, pull your car, full of savage on a mission for the cabbage. Peace, no woman down the state. The steady mama chief and now you know what the name is Real need is where I come from Four corner southwest sun heating up Check the map southeast 435 bitch That's what's huh. up Loaded and ready chopping Oh 4, 4, 4, 4 That's what the 435 is on the album cover right So I don't know what tribe he's from though He's from the southwest Tunnel I'm in I can't do nothing right Pushing myself to the edge I'ma fight this fight it sounds pretty badass for so far with the uh, the way he um, I like his flow, his uh, his vocal delivery, his voice inflection, the smoothness of his voice. It sounds like he's straining a lot. And this hook, I like the hook. Oh, that sounds cool with the uh, like the robot sound in the background. You burn the ashes, crushing game call the smashes. Enough set bitch, get it cracking. Native on the rise, gonna blow like mines. Run for life, I gotta find my life. Apply pressure now, it's power mines. Power moves, stay on my grind. Open up shop, hustle around the clock. Dough a mouth, always bound to shock. Scheme a plot, cream of the crop. You see me now when you're talking loud. Real sweet, I talk in your back and now. Suck a bitch, what you know about a cheap, huh? Mama, do these avenues, get it correct. Bitch. That was actually yes, really good up? verse. Grinding I like on that. my power moves, get it correct, bitch. Yes, what's up? Catch me push it up like a mad truck, get it correct, bitch. Yes, what's up? Still on my seven shit, get it correct. Bitch. I can imagine yes, listening to this in my Jeep, Gotta turning it all the way up and feeling the, the, correct, the back bitch. of my yes, seat vibrating from the bass. Boss, Some badass verses. That's for sure, fuck these hoes Trying to wreck my goals Duty calls, married to my hustle So the game got my soul Jones, A, G, up Mama, do these avenues Get it correct, bitch Yes, what's up? I like that Grinding on my power moves That's Get it correct, badass. bitch Yes, what's up? Catch me push it up like See, this is what I love about it music correct, you, can, you can listen yes, to all kinds I mean, you Still can make any type of music correct, And as long as you do it yes, well People will respond get to it where you from, man Get it correct, bitch Yes, what's up? That's that's pretty badass. I think that right there, that uh, the hook, if it had uh, like uh, kids in the background or, or like uh, chicks or something like that to really harmonize and bring it in, that would have been really cool. Because um, right now, listening to it, it's just one guy going through the whole the whole the whole track, and it's there's no real separation because even when he did the hook, it was it almost sounded like the same the same um, style as how he was doing the verse which is by and large not that bad but when i'm listening to something i want to hear the difference between the hook and the verse um instantly i don't want to have to guess oh this is where the hook's coming in or this is where the hook is at i want the hook to jump out slap me in the face and say i'm the hook and and uh but other than that for the, for being the very first uh, song coming off a debut album uh this actually sounded really badass i think his vocal delivery was on point his uh lyricism is really good he's not the greatest obviously and this is just one song can't judge how he is as a lyricist um but with the with 
with really good vocal uh, delivery that he has, I would like to hear better lyrical uh, delivery as well because the two just go real well together. Like uh, the artist Mac Fox, that dude has a badass gruff sounding voice. He flows really good and his lyrics are nuts. I mean, um, it's, it's like Superman. When you listen to Superman, Superman has some really intense lyrics. You're like, oh shit, how did you, how did you even think of pairing that with that? Uh, but that's the difference between an MC, a rapper, and, and, and uh, somebody who's just rapping and rhyming. I don't know what this guy is yet because I haven't heard all his music, but it sounds pretty badass. And the music uh, genre sounds like it's a mixture between Midwest and uh, West Coast style of uh, music. And I'm, I'm talking about the beats and I'm talking about the vocal delivery. It sounds really hardcore, sounds tough. Coming out of the, uh, the four corners, I hear a lot of music. And um, a lot of times I'm just like, eh, it's cool. I like it. Um, but I do notice one difference between uh, music from indigenous rap artists and hip hop artists from the States compared to indigenous hip hop artists from Canada. Canada is making a lot of dance style oriented type of music and they get a lot of funding from their from their government over there. And I know that's one of the big things down here. It's all self-made and, and people don't have any funding from any tribal outlet or anybody funding them. It's it's all independent. So I'm wondering if this guy's independent. Uh, so Jones A, after you listen to this review, when I post it online, give me a contact, brother, because uh, I'd like to sit down and do an interview with you, Skype interview or something, talk about your music, talk about your project. Uh, but all in all, very impressed. Some really good stuff. Keep it up. So until next time, everybody, I'm Tito. If you got music, send me your music. Doesn't matter what genre. I listen to everything from death metal, orchestra music, hip hop, peyote, powwow, uh, spoken word, flute music, uh, whatever the fuck you got. I want to check it out if you're an indigenous artist. And um, today is October 25th, 2015. You're watching the Native Entertainment Show. Remember to support the show. Buy some of our products. We've got some Christmas gift ideas, sweaters, pullovers, um, spaghetti strap shirts for uh, for the ladies. And uh, we also got 3D printed jewelry. And we got a lot of stuff. We got music. You, we're also streaming music 24-7 on, on uh, the website at nativeentertainmentmagazine.com. And you can go listen to music free of charge. It's not going to cost anything. Just go enjoy native-made music. If you got music that you want played um, uh, on the website, just let us know. Um, until next time, everybody, I'm Tito. Again, it's a Native Entertainment Show. This has been my music review of Jones A. That's what's up. And, uh, oh, you know what? Before I go, I do got to point out something here. Uh, so the graphics are, are done really well, but they're confusing as fuck. You know, so I'm looking at this. I'm seeing 435. I'm seeing Zach Jones. I'm seeing the Jones A. And, you know, that, it's, that's, that's too much confusion. You need to make it as simple as possible for a consumer, for somebody who is an audiophile like myself, somebody who loves music and I want to go. But, but someone like myself who is also going to be looking for graphics and artwork to be able to be compelled to be drawn in. I'm old school. I love this kind of stuff. So I would recommend touching up that graphic and even getting rid of that graphic for the, even if it's just on the SoundCloud because that's what's up is the name of the jam. But who is the artist? Is the artist Jones A? Is the artist Zach Jones? What is 435? Because there's too much stuff going on. Put the name of the artist, put the name of the song, and at the very bottom somewhere, you can put the name of the record label. Way at the bottom, out of the way, or just, you know, you know, make sure it's not confusing so that somebody's not looking at us and think, wondering what the fuck is going on. But until next time, everybody, I'm Tito. Remember to smile at somebody.